Um, we did let them out yesterday. Uh, a few of them came out, flew across to the other lofts, and, and then came back over and you know, landed back onto their aviary and everything. Um, we obviously over our last couple of videos have been doing some trap training with them, and so hopefully that when they come out, uh, when they're whistling back in, they might use the trap. So let's see how that goes, and uh, so let's go let them out. Right. So. Uh, First things first, I've got to take this chain off just because there's a overhang at the top. Uh, when the wind gets up, it can rip under here and it can take the roof off if you're not careful. So we're just going to take the chain off. Not as easy to do with one hand. Hi, babies. Are you ready to come out? I'm just going to take this off the top first because uh, obviously we don't need that at the minute hopefully that um, when they come out and when we shout them back in later that they will uh, come back in through there that's 49er oh they seem to have taken themselves to bed that uh, loft there that we've sh shown you before we start any work on it obviously we've given it a bit of a paint over on the outside put some new perspex on um i'll do a updated video on that oh that's it a couple of them out on the floor so hopefully start coming out when they realize not that one over there, that's a young stock bird there wanting to come out. <laughs> Here they are. Yay, good babies! Where have you gone? There you are. So they're all just coming to the front of the aviary. Oh, they're starting to build a bit of confidence. They're coming out. <sighs> they weren't this quick to come out yesterday. Oh, one's gone for a fly over there. Hello, you three. <laughs> oh, and the sound of Avery. Oh, there's one there. They're more confident at coming out today. <laughs> Still getting used to how to land, how to use, <laughs> use the wings. But that one um, that I said the other day about that it, it got out and uh, well, it went, went disappearing for the night. Uh, it come back, obviously it was here the next morning. It's, uh, sat there on top of the every door it was uh, yeah, it came out yesterday just flew around the lofts and then went back in so I think it realised it didn't want to be out there on its own Seven out on the floor, one on top of the Avery. And two still inside it, not quite got the confidence to come out yet. <laughs> got a 49er over there. And Geronimo. <laughs> Where are you going? 
So, once I've had like 20 minutes out, uh, hopefully we can give them a whistle and they'll possibly use the trap. We'll see how that one goes. I'm definitely getting more confident. <laughs> oh, that one's gone off. <laughs> Flying around the tree. Hey, yo, darling. <laughs> I think they're enjoying themselves. Oh, there's that one. What you got there, man? <laughs> I'm just going to go and shut the aviary up just so they can uh, use the trap to get back in. Because they're now all out. There we go. It's all shut up. And a little wander around. So I'm just going to whistle them to see if they'll come back in through the uh, bob wires because we've shut the front of the aviary up. Good babies. Two on the grass down there. And over there. Go, babies. Nine down. It took its time. It took its time. Just got one more. Just one more to get up. We have to come back to you in a bit once we've uh, got this one back up because I think it's got a bit lost. together um don't think it went too bad uh, some of them got a little bit lost and weren't quite sure how to get back up to the top and got stuck underneath the aviary weren't quite sure how to get up there um but a bit of encouragement and they 
eventually came back in. Um, so yeah, it wasn't too bad. The building confidence well. Uh, it was obviously the first time that they've all come out together and had a little potter about on the grass. We've only had a few of them come out uh, and do that. Um, so we'll just see uh, how things go and hopefully things keep progressing as it has done.